a hurricane caused a lot of damage to this small town neighborhood. The following day, a woman was surprised to see a dog walking by itself, carrying something inside, a huge bag. Sinton, which is a city located on the edge of Texas, had a population of under 6,000 residents. Because it is such a small area, many of the residents are good friends and everyone is always updated about the most recent event. There was a family who ended up in the news, but it wasn't because of something that they did, rather, it was because of their dog. The Segovias had lived in their family home for many years. Their dog, Otis, was a large brown German shepherd mix who stood out from the crowd. He had joined the family when he was just a puppy. Otis belonged to six-year-old Carter Segovia, but things changed when the boy and his parents left the neighborhood to escape the flood caused by Hurricane Harvey. Salvador Segovia, Carter's grandfather, had stayed behind in Sinton and promised to take Otis under his wing until his grandson returned. Salvador was actually the one who first found the puppy. Many years ago, a man had Otis in his car and was driving around town looking for a place to drop him off. The man didn't want to look after the dog, but the thought of the poor animal being abandoned broke his heart. The man then offered Otis to Salvador, who took the pup in immediately. No, 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 leave him here, said Salvador, we'll keep him. The dog then went on to become Carter's pet. The young boy was delighted to have a new member in their family. In fact, the whole family speaks very highly of Otis. Even though they have described the dog as having a sad-looking face, his fluffy coat and sweet nature makes him very charming. Everyone finds the dog to be approachable and easy to like. People just admire him whenever they see him, said Salvador. It wasn't uncommon to hear of pets in the area. All across the USA, dogs are the most popular pets. They are loyal creatures, perfect for both families and single people. Otis had all the typical traits that called people towards dogs. However, there was something special about Otis. Although many people own dogs, it's a general rule that they are not allowed in specific buildings or locations because they can be loud and hard to control. For example, many restaurant owners ban animals from entering. Not Otis. The lovable brown dog had never experienced this. Whenever the young pooch craved a burger, he had the permission to go to Dairy Queen and grab one there. The dog had been well known all throughout the town, but his shot to stardom took place soon after the hurricane hit. The story was well documented by a woman named Tieli Dawkins. Tieli had only recently moved to the Texan area and she was still getting to know the people there. The day after the storm hit, she went outside to check how her neighbors were faring. Fortunately, there wasn't a lot of damage in her area and nobody was hurt. She had a few more errands to run before heading home. While she was walking along the pavement, the woman spotted a dog carrying a huge bag. The dog was all alone. Although the bag seemed heavy and full of several items, the German Shepherd mix carried it with ease. At first, she was a little concerned for the dog, believing it to either be a stray or lost. So Tieli took her phone out from her pocket and took a picture of the animal. Tieli planned on posting the picture of the dog online later in case someone was looking for it. She was still worried that the dog needed help, so the woman rushed over to catch up with the canine. The dog had sensitive ears and could hear the lady from behind. It turned to face her and dropped the bag. Then, as she approached the dog to take a closer look, her heart melted. Filled to the brim, the bag contained dog food. There was enough food to feed the animal for a long time. After looking at the woman, the dog picked up the bag and continued to walk down the street. Tieli assumed that the dog was heading back to where its owners were. It's like he's on a mission, Tieli thought to herself. She thought the dog was adorable. It didn't feel right to leave the little creature by himself, so she joined him on his journey. The pair walked for a few miles before finally reaching the dog's destination, the Segovia family home. Tieli stepped up to the front door and knocked. Almost instantly, the door opened, revealing an elderly man. Salvador did not recognize the woman and asked if she was all right. She nodded enthusiastically. Is that your dog coming down the road? Tieli asked. She then moved aside, pointing towards Otis. Salvador was happy to see his beloved pet and waved at him. The dog headed towards them, still carrying the huge bag. As soon as he reached the door, he sat the bag down, revealing the handfuls of food within. 
Salvador was proud of how resourceful Otis was and leaned down to give the canine a big hug. He knows where to go to pick up a treat, he explained, after being interviewed about the situation. Otis's full bag most definitely showcases the dog's cleverness. Now that Otis had finally returned home, Salvador was able to connect all the pieces and figure out everything that had happened. For several days, the neighborhood had been preparing for Hurricane Harvey. The locals heard from the news and weather forecast that it was going to be very dangerous, so people either stocked up for food inside their homes or evacuated the city. Because Salvador chose to stay, he had to follow protocol and get his house ready for any potential dangers. During Friday night, the elderly man moved some items around his house. It had been some time since he last saw Otis, but he simply assumed that the canine was sitting quietly on the back porch. However, the dog actually found the storm distressing and couldn't stay still. Salvador had left some food and water out on the porch, but Otis couldn't eat at the time. After hearing a loud noise, Otis jumped in fear and busted the screen door open. The dog ran for miles. By the time that Salvador finished preparing the house, Otis was already gone. Salvador called for his dog through the windows, shouting at the top of his lungs. Still, there was no response and it was too late for him to go searching for him. He would have to wait until the following day. Since everyone stayed inside their home due to the hurricane, there was no one who could give Otis his usual ice cream or hamburger at Dairy Queen. Instead, the canine must have gone to one of the local supply stores to go looking for some dog food. Inside one of the lumber stores was a full shelf of Ol' Roy, which is Otis's favorite. When the sun had risen and all seemed safe again, Salvador left the house to go search for Otis. He still couldn't find him, even after hours of looking. The elderly man went back to his house, praying for the dog to return. Soon after, Tieli and Otis came knocking on his door. Tieli posted the picture she took of Otis online, which led to everyone asking about the story behind the dog and the huge bag it was carrying. The woman provided an explanation in her caption. This dog is walking around Sinton, Texas, carrying an entire bag of dog food with him. LOL, hashtag, refugee, PSA, owner is found. He is not a stray, he just got out on his street. Dog's name is Otis. The Facebook picture quickly spread among people within and outside of the Sinton community. Since it was first uploaded, Tieli's post of Otis and his bag has been shared more than 39,000 times. Not long after, the story gained enough attention to be shown on the news. After the picture of Otis blew up on the internet, many people started calling the dog and his heavy bag a symbol of resilience. The floods caused by Hurricane Harvey disrupted many people's lives. However, everyone who was involved put on their brave face and tried their hardest to help each other out. We may not be able to control natural disasters, but the resilience of communities will always be the light at the end of the tunnel. Thank you for watching this incredible story. What part did you like most? If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more content just like this. Take care. I'll see you soon.